Alabama Prison Profiles. Alabama in the house. Shout out. Shout out Alabama. Alabama Prisoner Profiles, The Voice checking in. What's good, y'all? Shout out to everybody messing with the socials. Y'all know what's going on. Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, blah, blah, blah. Notification bell, subscribe, like button, blah, blah, blah. Man, I want to jump right into this, y'all. I done left my fucking tablet at home, so I'm going to have to freestyle this back and forth, read, memorize, and try to regurgitate it, but this ain't long. It's going to be a short one here. Granny caught with the work at Donaldson, you know what I'm saying? We're going to get into this story. It's a wild one here. Um wildness all right 60 year old nina rogers goldsmith was arrested this past thursday at donaldson correctional facility and as y'all can see the charges in the top right she's charged with promoting prison contraband first palm marijuana first and drug trafficking methamphetamine wild now they say miss rogers was in charge of running the commissary store the prison commissary so zooms and whams she giving out zooms and whams and serving zooms and whams you know what i'm saying wow but they also say that that's not the only thing she had on her other than meth and marijuana sources say that she also had that finny that fetty that fentanyl on her you know what i'm saying and two higher ups i'm gonna have to go back and look see who they are higher ups felt sorry for her right and didn't want her to spend the rest of her you know short-lived life bro 60 maybe you can get you know 20 more years in you know what i'm saying um incarcerated because with these charges yeah that's that's definitely where she's headed you know what i'm saying unless she gave up the entire program which i would if i was 61 she probably been there 20 30 or some shit like that i don't who knows you know what i'm saying go and give it up you know what i'm saying take your little probation them folks is already locked up you know what i'm saying go on start back going to church and try to get back right with the lord you know what i'm saying sources say a lieutenant harris and a captain saunders or the two uh, correctional staff that flushed the fentanyl um, that felt bad for Miss Rogers, and which we all kind of do. I mean, it's crazy. The motherfuckers just want to get some money. You know what I'm saying? I feel bad for her as well as I do. That officer of the prize video here by just want to get some money you know what i'm saying it's too it's very enticing you know what i'm saying it's just i don't know man from what i see in the test you just can't have no long run with this shit or nothing like that it's crazy you know what i'm saying uh crazy you know when i was looking at on the facebook apps and groups people are all actually speculating that they don't even think these officers flush the fan. They think they went ahead and yeah, they went ahead and yeah, you know what I'm saying? Cuff that, redistribute that, you know what I'm saying? Who knows, you know what I'm saying? Now she has bonded out, so hopefully she can, you know, come from under this, but you know, they usually have these kind of cases. These folks is dead to rights, you know what I'm saying? But y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comments. DC the voice checking out. Y'all know what's going on.